What is going on fellas and welcome back to another episode of our Sin City Saints franchise. Today we are taking on the most annoying team in the NFL, the Carolina Pantheruno's. Cam Newton is complete AIDS in this game. The rest of his team as far as I'm concerned is complete AIDS. Last time we lost in a complete piss take, mate. We got ripped off by the CPU. But this time we're gonna come back and be twice as strong. We have 262 scouting points because last week we did have a bye week. Wanna show you guys what's going on. Quarterback's pretty much already scouted. We only have a fifth round pick after that if I'm not mistaken, that's correct. Oh, look at this guy. Damn, he's flying under the radar. Any B pluses, B pluses, we got a B plus. He's trash, B plus, B and B, he's not bad. Now, if you go to cornerback, I did find somebody in the fifth round. We might have to trade up just a little bit. But this guy right here, CJ Winborn from Arkansas, B plus, B and C plus in the fifth round. And he's not a prototype, so I know he's good. Other than that, I'm not sure exactly what we need. We need O-Lyman, but... It's not really a, a concern right now, you know? Check this out. Christian Stupa has 30,000 XP, mate, in week 11. This guy is leading for MVP. This guy's going to have, like, clean 130k. And Upshore is lucky that I can't trade his ass. I'm not going to spoil it for you. Go see last episode if you haven't. He needs to go, even though he's great. That being said, let's not waste any more time. Without further ado, let's get it. That was a surprising three and out, man. Let's get Le'Veon Bell going back there. The only reason I'm having reinforcements go back there is because I'm legitimately scared that Upshore is going to do something stupid, mate. He's going to find a way to do something stupid. Uh-oh. Ooh, okay, okay. <laughs> Respects to him. Alright guys, so this is Postcom Crow, just with a little bit of an update right here. So, I'm editing this video right now, and it appears at this very moment, the microphone decided to randomly cut out. Now, I've been having issues with my microphone lately, however, I figured out what the issue is, and it's now resolved. But just for this episode, let it be known right now that for the next couple minutes, you are going to be hearing the trashest microphone audio, because it is my camera audio, in fact. Now, it only lasts for a couple minutes, so just bear with me. When I'm not speaking, I've completely cut out the trash mic, so you won't even hear it. But yeah, I just thought I'd let you guys know in advance so you don't think like, what the hell, why did Perrin Crow just become a futuristic robot? Enjoy. Ah! I cannot wait until we snag Philip Ross and Joe McIntyre, dude. Plays like this are gonna be so much fun. This guy stupa? Actually, you know what? Let's take this out to the right side. Let's have a change of heart, you know? I come back on him again! You know what? I didn't even put on my coaching adjustments for that either. Ball carrier can go on aggressive. Blocking was going to keep on balance. Deep pass can go on aggressive. This can go on conservative. We go. Possession catch cheese. What? Jay Cutler just threw an absolute nub, my dude, and that was the Ted Ginn. That's an uncommon connection if I've ever seen it. Light him up, Buchanan. Uh oh, uh oh. I don't know who Artis Payne is. Maybe Jonathan Stewart got injured. Mm, I wonder what happened to him. Is he on injury? They're going to run this, by the way. Now do you see why I don't like versing Cam Newton? Troll us! Troll us! I understand completely that's what we're gonna be doing with Joe next year, but it's never fun to have it done to you, ever. Especially by the bitch ass CPU, man. But I so deserve that, man. I got triggered from that damn. Oh! Okay, John Sullivan laying the smack down. Okay. Oh, hold on a second, guys. It appears my, my microphone's been playing up. Ah, this is a pain in the ass when this shit happens, mate. I tell you. That only recorded four minutes, bro. So that means that I've had the shitty mic going for like six minutes. That's bad. All right. What? Nah. Nah. 
Don't even try, mate. You got lucky the first time. It should be a touchdown if they don't adjust their defense. Uh-oh. They got me good there. Rack catcher, Kobe Fleener. All right, I see you, my dude. Let's take this out to the right because the left is incredibly congested and I don't have... How stupid gonna be great if I can't get any blocks? What is this defense, bro? The conjoined twins defense. I see it everywhere. Why am I trying to juke? Go! <laughs> Running back screen. I never, ever call these plays and I'm sure we're about to see why. Yeah, that's why because there's no... Ah, oh, it's too bad. Oh, he's blitzing. Hopefully they play man coverage. I haven't seen him play man once. Uh oh. Well, there we go again. Okay, nice, nice. But Oh, there we go. Oh! There we go. Touchdown. Touchdown, bitch. Touchdown, bitch. There we go. I need somebody else to do something, though. There's been too many stupid duper thumbnails. Bruh, <laughs> they're testing fate. There we go. Use a sack. Let's go up short. Don't drop it. Don't do something stupid. Alright, you need to up your spin move. I know where all your XP is going. Probably into not messing up punt returns and spins. But, fell for that, didn't ya? Hey? <laughs> oh, it's a pass. So I jumped on the wrong man. This actually has been a very close game. We're only up by one point, my dude. Second and four. Is this going to be some cheese? Let's move the line out to the left. Passing play. Get your trout. Come on, come. Cheese eyes read options. Why would you, German? You just smacked Buchanan in the back. He's on our team. There we go. Smacked him. Let's get our hard flats, just in case, you never know. Gonna run it! Nah, nah, <laughs> you ain't getting away from me that easy, my dude. I know you think you're JT Hall, but you're not. These guys never play man coverage, which is the only thing that's kind of daunting me right now, you know? Oh, this is man coverage. I'm sure he holds on to it. Let's go. We got plenty of time though, yo. We can just move this slowly as long as we get our blocks and we just do our offense. High snap. Oh, he's sticky. I will beat your ass whoever just face masked my damn MVP. You know what? Just for that, I'm going to start chewing the clock because we're in field goal range. This is GG. It's all over. You just messed up by doing that. Oh. Let's go. Go. You're gonna have to start calling timeouts. Why why do we have all passing plays, bro? We're winning the game, you idiot. Use your but this is starting to look like the 2K rebuilds. Nobody knows what they're doing with their teams. See, look. There you go. That better not I swear if that is stupid, I am turning off the game and resetting it. Bitch. Here we go. Gotta love the glitch, mate. Where's Stupa? Where's our running back? I'm gonna see if I can get an interception with him. I can't change. I'm stuck on Kobe Fleener. Kobe Fleener on defense? Yeah, that's what you get. That's what you get for face masking, my dude. <laughs> They're calling hurry up. Stupid duper, the running back is on the D line, my dude. That pass rush, though. <laughs> I hope they keep that glitch in just for the lols, you know? If you ever want to pull it out. Pick. Careful, you throw this ball, my dude. He got it. No, we got it. Who got it? That's interesting. Why did it come up with the moves for him? That's cheese, dude. Oh, that looked like it hurt. Any last yards? We need to make sure we pick him up now. And I'm not scared. I'm going to run straight over to this left side, try and run through or run around this guy. 
Ooh, they got a bit aggressive with my boy Stupa. Bit jelly, huh? Alright, so checking out the stats on the day. Jay Cutler with a 103.8 passer rating. 75% completion rate. Once again, terrible TD to interception ratio. But still, like, he's doing his thing out there. He's getting the job done, and that's all that matters. Rushing in a thing, Stupa, 132 yards, 2 touchdowns off 20 carries, man. Do what he's seeing. 6 broken tackles on the receiving end of things Ted Ginn Jr. with that amazing catch man Jay Cutler to Ted Ginn that was immaculate on the defensive end of things Cameron Jordan six total tackles Chandler German was six we didn't get any interceptions today however he picked up three sacks German Jordan and Thomas Michael Thomas got a sack the wide receiver. Man, I love that glitch. But that being said, fellas, if you made it this far, you are the real MVP. Hope the rest of your day is awesome. And for me personally, I'm out. Peace. Tell me pretty lies. Look me in the face. Tell me that you love me. Even if it's fake. Cause I don't fucking care. At all. You've been out all night. I don't know where you've been. You're slurring all your words. Now